Uh, my father's been in business for 30 years doing plumbing, heating, uh, electrical work in the area. And uh, back in 2007, I started working for him full time. Um, and as I was taking classes to get my electrical uh, license in New York State, um, got a phone call from Seeds. They were just starting up at that time uh, and was offering some solar hot water courses, solar electric, windmill courses. Uh, to any contractors that were interested and so we said sure we'll we'll take the classes and from there kind of pursued that and, and fell into some other courses and, and certifications and all that and I mean here we are seven years later uh, mm -hmm. it seems to be the majority of our business is renewable energy between the solar the wind the uh, pool heating um, solar thermal and, and also wood pellet boilers uh, it really is is kind of changing the uh, the scope of how people use energy in their homes so it's it's pretty exciting but this system is is quite simple uh, solar hot water is the cheapest to install uh, initially and quickest payback um, it's kind of hard to chart to, to keep uh, a good idea of, of what you are saving or what you're going to save because solar or uh, just domestic hot water in general is something that uh, you can't really put your thumb down and say I definitely use uh, you know 400 gallons of hot water a month uh, I take five minute showers some people might take 10 minute showers other people might take two showers a day three showers a day I'm not sure what your preference is but um, so it's a little bit hard to keep track of what you are saving generally rule of thumb we like to say at least four hundred dollars or five hundred dollars a year in savings and uh, depending on the size of your home um, people in your home you know how much uh, stay-at-home moms tend to be a little bit more uh, heavy on the hot water demand but this simple this is a simple system it's just uh, one panel on the roof and a storage tank in the basement uh, there's no water in the system at night or when the panel is not hot enough to uh, heat anything up so at night or during the winter uh, the during the night during the winter you don't have to worry about freezing um, there's a sensor on the roof and there's a sensor on the tank in the basement and there's a little control box that says okay the sensor on the roof says I'm hot and the sensor on the tank says I can use some heat so we're going to turn the circulator on and the circulator pumps water up through uh, it circulates the water heats it up and there's a heat exchanger in the basement that then transfers that water to the storage tank um, once that's warm enough and satisfied everything shuts off and the water is what we call a drain back system and all the water just simply drains back to the basement and there's no water in the lines there's no water anywhere except for in the basement you don't have to worry about freezing at all it's uh it's very uh, there's a variety of different ways you can do solar hot water but this is the the way we prefer uh simply because i sleep better at night knowing that if the power goes out somebody's circulator pump isn't not working to keep their pipes from freezing because uh, once that freezes or once uh if the panel gets too hot and it's full of antifreeze some systems have antifreeze in them mm -hmm. and it gets too full and crystallizes then all of a sudden your panels on your roof are all junk you got to take them down and put new ones on so uh, simple system you just got to pipe your system uh, pipe your uh, tubing uh, to drain and drain it back to the basement and that's about it uh, the sun comes out you get hot water the sun goes down you don't so <laughs> it's not rocket science, you know. Make people... hot water when the sun shines. Exactly. <laughs> yep. You could hear the water flowing up through the pipes, so it sounds pretty cool. Mm -hmm. you can hear it. That's uh, a nice little uh, sound to hear because mm -hmm. you know you're saving some energy, saving some yeah. water. You can hear it. Mm -hmm.